if there was ever a series that has us thinking it may have nine lives and possibly more, it is The Game, which made its debut in 2006 on The CW, lasting for three seasons, and then moved on to BET, where it made cable viewership history. Altogether, The Game ran for nine seasons, and just when we thought it was down and out, the series is going for another long run, this time in Sin City. And what happens in Vegas will definitely not stay in Vegas because the woman behind Boss Lady Tasha Mickety Mack is here with us this morning. Please welcome my Shiro actress, Wendy Raquel Robinson! Wow, what an amazing introduction. Thank oh, you. Let me tell you. Shiro. Shiro because yes. it was what LaVita Alizé Jenkins used to call you on the Steve Harvey show. That was where oh. I got the word Shiro the first time. Because wow, you just took me all the way back. Don't get me emotional. I'm a Shiro, honey. Shiro's yeah, you a are. Rock. You were a Shiro <laughs> to her. And I was dying over Principal Greer. I, I was like, I want Principal Greer to be my principal. I was already done with high school then. I don't know what I, I was thinking. Look, I wanted her to be my principal. How about that? I look, wanted to steal her clothes. Yeah, that you wish you had in real life. Exactly. Oh my God. So let me tell you, so you are our Shiro in more ways than you can even imagine. And Thank now you. with this role as Tasha Mack, which we, we got to enjoy you for like all those seasons previously. And when I heard it was coming back, I was like, how are they going to do this? What are they going to, how are they going to get us back in the game? And let me tell you, right. after seeing the episodes that are out now, because I've seen all of them, all I can say is touchdown. Or we had overtime, baby. Oh my God, thank you so much. Cause you know, we were really nervous and you know, it's like, okay, how is this gonna be perceived? Yeah. How are we gonna come back after all of these seasons and bring something fresh, but still familiar and keep it moving. But I gotta give it up to the writers, the new executive producer, Devon Gregory. He really thought outside of the box and created something that, like I said, it's grounded, but it's still fresh. Still familiar, yep. but at the same time, it's, it's bringing on all these new elements. And so I love how you guys have the OGs and then you have the new bloods. And they, they still work. <laughs> yes! I love the way you said, OG, oh, the new blood. But but that's exactly what it is. I'm going to take that and borrow it. Okay. But yeah, you got your OGs that are still, you know, representing that world that we're very familiar with. But now it's also through the lens of these new bloods that are coming in and bringing new energy. And um, I just got to say, between Adrian Ray and Von Hebron, Toby Sandeman, and Annalisa Velez, they are really bringing the excitement, the joy. And we still have some of the old OGs that are yep. becoming as well mm -hmm. so it's 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 a dance that we're doing old school new school meets um oh i want to say a longevity school oh let me tell you <laughs> we're down we're down for whatever it is you're offering and we have a clip from the show so let's check it out and then check chat some more great seems we're swimming in we should grab dinner compare notes well a i'm married b i don't mix business with pleasure and c not this girl why it ain't right not between these guys a, you're barely married. B, I'm making my business to please you. And C, I am 116th Nigerian. Don't let my lack of melanin fool you. <laughs> you know what, Carol? You are a fool. Okay, look, but if you ain't talking business, you need to move on. Fair enough. You get your son to be my QB, I'll make Garrett the richest defender in the league. Now that is an offer that I cannot refuse. Okay, the Colonel over there, played by Tim Daly, is trying to put the Mac on Tasha Mac. By the way, I'm 100% Nigerian. He's 160th Nigerian. I vote for the Colonel. He has my vote. <laughs> you better call his but divorce I'm lawyer. Married, honey. It's like, wait a minute. Wait he, a minute. He's funny. He's grounded. He's sexy. And he's charming. And he's the owner. And it's like all this new swag that he's bringing to the show. And I just love it. We do, too. We do, too. No, by the way, let me tell you, your name came up the other day. Uh, Deshaun oh. Terry was here, and I told him... What? No, let me tell you, and I told him... We didn't even discuss you. I just... I knew that I heard him say somewhere that you were his <laughs> acting coach or something, and I just yes. said to him, I said, next time we meet, we're going to talk about this. I was like, what? You oh, people, my God. So you, you, are, you are, like, changing lives, like, in front of the camera, behind the camera, like, <sighs> just touching people like you don't even believe, from Insecure to your Christmas movies. It is just, <sighs> I cannot with you. I cannot. I should just talk Oh, you're going to make me cry. No, don't cry. Wow. I'm just saying. Like, it's, <sighs> it's unbelievable. 
Wow, 25 years ago, when I couldn't get a job, I couldn't get a return phone call, I couldn't get anything. And I had just graduated from Howard University. So I knew, you know, acting is something I always wanted to do. I was a drama major. And I, I founded, co-founded actually, Amazing Grace Conservatory. And that's where Deshaun Terry, he was one of my very first students. And just to see the trajectory of his career, Issa Rae is one of my babies, wow. Ashton Sanders, and to see how the seeds of your passion just really blossom and grow into these incredible artists that are, you know, they're conscious, they're giving back, they have integrity, and it just really, it warms my heart. I think it's going to be the greatest footprint I have ever, ever left on this planet. You know what I mean? Mm, yeah, I do. You wow. Are the, you are the gift that keeps on giving. I'm not talking about Aww. your Christmas movie. Thank you. So a Christmas family reunion is actually, it's on Lifetime and yep. it premieres uh, November 29th. So it's a great holiday movie mm -hmm. uh, to kick it off right after the holiday. But it's all about what happens when, you know, the nephew of the family meets somebody and brings it all to Christmas. And uh, it's, a, it's a very entangled story that, that's funny, it's rich, it's heartwarming. It's all that and then some and more. Of course, you can check her out on the game Paramount Plus on Thursdays. You don't want to miss it. It's amazing. I've, I've caught up and I can't wait to even see more. And for a second helping of Miss Wendy Raquel Robinson, watch her Lifetime Holiday movie, Welcome to the Christmas Family Reunion, this Monday.